So we got the first round of the APC. Some really good players. You got Yama Jeremont. You got Saduga. Yaf and Aeon. Taking on Freshie and Armageddon on a map that has a ridiculous amount of mass. You can see here Freshie going with uh, first air, then NG. This will be mostly a highlight. You guys should uh, watch the uh, live stream of the APC if you want the whole game. Here we see Freshie's bomber. This is uh, pretty early. You can see what he's going to be doing with it. He's going to bomb Yama. See, he's really slowed it down a lot before he drops the bomb. Takes out an NG. Looks like he will go after another. See all those build orders cancelled. See a lot of flak being made by both players here. Both Saduga and Yama. And a total of two kills for that bomber. You can see uh, Yama has sent in a few uh, uh, flares which got taken out by Thams. It's a pretty hard map to see anything, it's so white. But there is so much mass, including in the mountains. Back here it's meant for four players. There's basically a big path through the middle, plus some little paths on the mountains. If you can capture one of these mountains, probably can rain down uh, arty and missiles on your opponent. You can see a nice ferry route made by Armageddon. He's going to try to take over his mountains. Not much fighting early on. Now we're a minute six looking down the path. See, neither uh, team really wants to engage with T1. You can see a small base being built by Saduga, a base by Armageddon. So both teams really trying to capture all as much mass as they can. And now we can actually see some Auroras moving in from Freshy. Uh, run into a superior force from Yama. And that was probably a mistake, some nice wreckage in the middle now. But it looks like this mass has so much uh, ice and snowballs all around that. Yeah, and now we see Saduga actually rolling through with UEF. They're very good tanks for this type of terrain. Definitely in terms of T1, uh, we got Saduga and Yama really dominating. At least numbers early on. We see a lot of factories from Freshie though. You should be able to build up a nice force. A lot of T1 air as well. See it drop. Coming in from Yama. It's going to try to prevent the expansion of Armageddon. Now we see this battle between UEF and Aeon. That UEF just dominates. See a nice T2 from Armageddon. We might see some Yoshivas, which will put a stop on this advance. Definitely a lot of mass for Armageddon and Fresh after these Yoshivas uh, stop this assault. Certainly in a map with so much mass, uh, going with T1, it's a big gamble. You're just basically providing mass for the other team. See a lot of plans. Now we actually see a fight here in the mountains. We got Aurora versus Aurora. Aeon on Aeon. And uh, on the bottom here, it looks like Saduga is going to roll through Armageddon's early base. It looks like uh, this mountain here is in danger of being lost for Armageddon. A lot of mass to reclaim here. Coming up on the middle 11, we see Yama really uh, winning his battle in the mountains as well. Uh, beating down Freshie here if he can get some PD up or something. 
otherwise these auroras will just roll through. And in the middle we see some T2, the Yoshivas, are going to run into a much bigger force and will be a pulled back. This mass should be getting reclaimed. See some pillars and shields from UEF. As well as some T2 flak. And it appears that Sadugo has won the mountains for the most part. And actually his ally is ahead of him. So the right mount here completely belongs to the top team. The left is about to be uh, taken over as well. If you look at the map here, it looks like the strategy for uh, Freshy was to make a whole bunch T1. Might not be the best because it's hard to fit a lot of units through all these small cracks. See, T2 flag here versus T1 air is just going to be deadly. That is a pretty big force that's being built up. Some T1 uh, PD. Yeah, you can see the Yoshua's. Could be a little bit of danger, but Armageddon should use his uh, overcharge to clean this stuff up. See shields and T2 PD. Really, uh, this attack will not be successful. Some more uh, mass for the bottom team here. It looks like it's a nice counter from a Freshi on top versus uh, Yama. Oh yeah, it's so much mass. It's great. Spam, spam power, reclaim, and upgrade mass extractors. Well, and this is going to be a bad situation here for uh, Armageddon. But very well placed uh, T1 PDs. Really got to get some arty here. It looks like uh, arty is kind of far away, or right here. There's no reason to lose all these units. 11 kills already for that T1 PD. So it could have been a good situation, but was uh, pretty much ruined. And now we're seeing T3. We see actually some Percy's. This is pretty amazing. We got Percy's coming down from Saduga. This could be pretty dangerous versus ACUs. And uh, Freshy here taking taking back the land with some obsidians. Actually, obsidians in this type of terrain could be very good.